In a matchup of the two top teams in the West, the Spurs cruise past the Thunder with a 105-93 victory. San Antonio improves to 6-2 without Tony Parker this season. Still the best record in the West. Yesterday, Stephen A., I don't think Jenner was on this, but you said that the uh, Spurs would win, 107 to 103. You're getting good at this. You actually kind of know what you're talking about. So I want to know. That's the, that's the breaking news. Breaking actually, news. Yeah. What, did you, what did you learn after last night's game? You see Skip always what has this. You he, see how he is? He, he, knows, he knows better. He uh -huh. knows better. Uh-huh, uh-huh. But Skip Bayless? <laughs> yes, Mr. Smith. Um... I'm not going to focus on the fact that you were wrong about something related to basketball yet again because that's just uh, that's just an exercise in redundancy, and we don't need to do that. Plus, you're my boy, and I don't feel like doing that to you. But I'm going to tell you something, Skip. I'm going to give you a little credit here, mm -hmm. and I'm going to make some news, and um, I got to compose myself because it's, it's, it's very difficult for me to say this. <coughs> Skip, I watched last night's game. And obviously, in order for Oklahoma City to beat the San Antonio Spurs, Kevin Durant is going to have to just step up and be more aggressive. I considered it nothing short of a basketball abomination that Russell Westbrook ended up taking 14 more shots than Kevin Durant. That's point number one. Thank you. Point number two, point number two, they really, really miss James Harden. Thank you. Particularly evidenced, particularly evidenced by Kevin Martin's limited play in the second half. No, he wasn't. He wasn't even in play. I mean, it doesn't make any sense. But I'm not going to sit there and critique Scott Brooks in that way because I'm sure he's got a plan. I believe in him as a coach. I think he knows what he's doing. But here's what it comes down to, Skip. The San Antonio Spurs. Not only do I believe they should be favored to win the West, but they're the best shot of beating the Miami Heat. And here's the breaking news, Skip. Good Lord, I can't believe I'm about to say this. <laughs> Skip Bayless, the reason why the San Antonio Spurs should be favored to come out of the West and would, 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 would make you the finals know, tough... Okay. Is because of the emergence of Tiago Splitter. Thank you. I mean, thank you. I, I just, thank I, I you. can't listen. This dude last year was dude. pretty close to a joke compared to yeah. what he's doing now. Yeah, now, I don't I know if it's the assistant coaches working out with him. I don't know if it's just the continued greatness of Greg Popovich. I don't know what to say, mm -hmm. but Tiago Splitter looks like a completely different basketball player than the Tiago Splitter that I watched last year. And let me tell you something. Kendrick Perkins and Serge Ibaka and Nick Collison, they're going to, and, and, and even if it's a C the B, they're going to have to step up their game if the Oklahoma City Thunder are going to beat the San Antonio Spurs because if you've got Splitter on the front line playing the way that he played last night with Tim Duncan, I can't see anybody in the West beating San Antonio. I, I just can't see it. I can't I, believe I, 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 what I'm seeing. Tiago Splitter it's crazy. has actually become mm -hmm. a, a decent basketball player. <laughs> he, he really is. I mean, I, I, it's not the Tiago Splitter that I saw when I was in Oklahoma City last year for the Western Conference Finals. It's not the Tiago Splitter that I saw last year when you brought him up and talked about he shoot, he sets a mean pick. He does. Not that, that, not that, not that Tiago does. Splitter. I'm not, to, I'm not talking about that Tiago Splitter. I'm talking about the Tiago Splitter that I've been watching emerge this season and that I saw play last night. This dude is a pretty decent big he's, man. He's pretty decent. And, 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 and if, it, if it continues, and I have no reason to believe it will not, I got to admit to you, we're looking at a San Antonio Miami Heat NBA Finals. Stephen A. If this continues. Stephen A. Skip often says he knows you better than you know yourself. Last night, he took to Twitter and knew, in fact, that you would be talking <laughs> about said individual by the name of Tiago Sawyer. I did. I well, predicted.